Well, good morning, ladies and gents. This is Tim Wall uh, doing the Latanya.co.slow report um, on the 9th of January. And the 9th of January is a special day today because my cameraman is Toffer and it's his birthday. So, happy birthday, Toffer. He's had three bottles of champagne at the Pomme de Pan. We've shared them, so he's already lost a ski just getting on the Rock Mounier. We're heading up to 1650 at the moment. And as you can see, it's pretty overcast, pretty windy, gusts of wind. And it is snowing as well, that's a good thing. We've had um, probably about 20 centimetres of fresh snow, but uh, they did forecast 60, but we've not had all that snow yet at the moment. And there are gusts of wind very, very high. Good news is, quite cold, down to about minus four, minus five. And with the wind chill factor, my cheeks are absolutely freezing and I can't speak very well at the moment, so I'm gonna cut it short. But we're on the Rock Monia chair. We've been out to the Pont de Pin, up the Verdon, and you can traverse all the way across on the top of the Verdon to Rock Mounier. We've just done it. Um, there's little pockets of powder as well, obviously, because it's windy. So in those sheltered areas, you get quite a bit of, uh, a bit of powder. But as I say, um, we forecast snow a little bit next week as well. And the avalanche danger is, I think it's only about two out of five at the moment, but surely with these conditions, it's going to uh, climb higher. So do be careful, off-piste is, uh, is uh, pretty uh, limited at the moment, so I wouldn't advise that. Just off the side of the piece, you might find a little bit of powder. Um, these three bottles of champagne are starting to <laughs> kick in. Um, so I'm going to uh, do a little bit more footage later on with Toffer, um, and we're heading down to 1650 for a quick bite to eat. Um, and then we'll do a little bit more skiing as well, hopefully. So from latanya.co.uk, this is Tim Wall. Um, two slow reports in four days. Um, get yourselves out here. I'll do a bit more footage later on. See you soon. So ladies and gents, we've made it down to 1650. Um, Hellishly high winds at the moment. We were, we've left uh, Mrs. Toffer, sorry Christine, we've left her behind a little bit. She's traversing with Ralph. We've had to get down to a two o'clock rendezvous for Toffer's birthday. Here we are at uh, the Coppina just opened and uh, we've got, uh, I'd say, mm, seven centimetres of fresh powder down in 1650, so not too bad. They did forecast 60 higher up. We've not had that yet, but there's more snow on the way on Sunday. So uh, things are looking up. If you're out this weekend, Well, what a big bag we've had today, ladies and gents. Uh, we're still out here. On... <laughs> we're still out here on the feast at 16:45. We caught from 16:50 the last, the last uh, chairlift up with the ski patrol at 16:30 uh, on the Aigle de Free. We've just skied down past the Alti Port, and here we are, just above the Courchenage, and the blue skies come out for us at quarter to five in the evening absolutely marvellous bloody cold very very cold and it's still snowing slightly as well hello hello um so there's all still skiers around but uh yeah it's absolutely great cold at the moment we've had that fall of snow and hopefully with this cold weather they'll be able to dam it down groom it and uh, it'll provide a little bit of a base because it is thin in parts off piece again you can see top if you spring around there there's still a few uh, Uh, side of the runs so all in all not a bad day and it's Toffer's birthday and we're still in one piece skiing down to uh, skiing down to the Prafra Van Show at five o'clock in the evening I've got all the ones to say from the Tanya Nakariki get yourselves out of here it's brilliant yeehaw Come on, I need these skis waxed. 